Sarasota County and the city of Sarasota continue to look for ways to handle the area's homeless problem. So today, county commissioners listened to leaders from a successful homeless shelter in Tallahassee. ABC 7's Rick Adams has a story. It's not that easy. It's, it's really, really hot outside right now. What Anthony Hager is talking about is being homeless. The street is where he's lived on and off for many years. He tells us he's all for a come-as-you-are homeless shelter that's currently being discussed in Sarasota County, even utilizing his construction skills. I would actually be willing to be part of building a place like that. Leaders from the Kearney Center for Comprehensive Emergency Services in Tallahassee spent their Tuesday in Sarasota. Its facility built from a public-private partnership. One of their stops was in front of county commissioners, where they talked about how they successfully helped the homeless with a dignified approach. Its founder, Richard Carney, believes it's success that can be enjoyed in Sarasota County as well. We've created a safe, respectful environment. It's healthy. There's no bed bugs. There's no communicable diseases. There's nobody with knives and guns. There's no fighting at night. Homelessness continues to be a very real problem here on the streets of Sarasota County. County officials are hopeful to have a solution soon to help these folks off the street. Many city leaders were in attendance listening closely to the discussion. Sarasota Commissioner Suzanne Atwell says the problem is at a critical level and they need to work closely with the county for answers, not disagree with each other like they have in the past. We're at a point now where we really, really need to do something, um, but we need to have a good plan. We certainly want to be part of those conversations. We envision ourselves to be supportive in many ways, um, but, but we want to work with others. ABC 7's Rick Adams reporting some county and city leaders did visit the shelter in Tallahassee and another visit is planned in the coming months.